Hello everyone, I'm Isan. In this video, we'll take a look at the latest updates on One UI 7.0, including some recent leaks and new features. First, let's look at the updated animations coming in One UI 7.0. The animations are now smoother with non-linear and parallel transitions. In the latest animation preview, you can see how each icon moves seamlessly to the next icon, allowing multiple animations to play at once without having to wait for the previous animation to complete. This makes everything feel faster and more fluid. This is a very exciting update from previous versions of One UI, which didn't always have smooth transitions. In previous versions, if you wanted to switch quickly to the next application, there was sometimes a slight delay as you waited for the prior animation to complete. Here even though One UI 6.1 animation already improved some smoothness over earlier versions, the animations in One UI 7.0 are noticeably smoother, offering an even more seamless experience. Next, let's look at the new live activities features on lock screen in One UI 7.0. At the beginning of the video, you'll notice the updated icons that differ from the previous One UI version. What's really cool here is that at the bottom of the lock screen, you can see multiple live activities happening. In the video preview, you'll notice various live activities in action, such as the no playing music, the sound recording, and also the timer. And all of these live activities are shown at the bottom of the lock screen. This leak confirms the appearance of the previous video from Mobile Lullaby, which shows the live activities display in the lock screen section. Here, when you press and hold on the live activity sections that are currently running, a preview will pop up displaying the ongoing live activities. This is of course different from the video player or live activities display in One UI 6.1 version, which is positioned in the middle of the lock screen. In this video, you can also check out the media player display in the quick panel. In this latest update, the media player is shown in the quick panel instead of the notification panel. This is part of the changes in One UI 7, where the quick panel and notification panel are now separated. However, you can also still combine them if you prefer the layout in this new version. When you choose to combine it together, the quick panel will look like this. Then in this video, we can also see the live notifications for sound recordings from the voice recorder application and also the live notification when the timer is activated from the clock application. These live activities will show up at the top of the notification panel section in the updated version of One UI 7. Hope you found this video helpful. See you in the next one.